Can you play over there so I, so Papa can do this here right quick? Come on, come on. Can you play with the toys right here? I learned this metal trait uh, when I was 15 years old in Germany in a Catholic monastery. I was introduced to this blacksmith and I only had to see him strike the amber one time and see the sparks and the fire and I knew that's what I'm going to do. 84, I came to America and I discovered this beautiful metal work that, that is unique to Detroit. So we in Detroit right here as the car manufacturing of the world, um, the access to everything that is automotive, it's so great. And so that's at the center point of my innovation. And then also the light poles, all my windmills working on some sort of reclaimed light pole, that this whole tower right here is made out of four discarded light poles. Come on, let's go upstairs. It's uh, 36 feet high. I was saying everybody should have a sky tower right next to your house. And we measured this, the efficiency about three blade systems. You know, see how much wind you need to even just kick this thing in, where do all those other ones are going effortless. They're not even low to the ground. But it's an ongoing experiment to study and see how low level wind behave and go and how can you harness it. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Say, hey, Toledo. <laughs> I can build anything and invent anything and design anything that is metal. I love the D sign right there. The eye is constructed out of the original I beam that was used in the Civil War. You know, I know metal like I know my, like I know myself. So if I would not have seen this blacksmith, I wouldn't know what my life would turn to.